Uh, what are your thoughts on just how everything unfolded? Yeah. yeah, you know, they got a, a few breaks, bounces on their goals, obviously, uh, right away um, for them to score. Is, you know, <laughs> we talk about it, but, uh, you know, it just fortunately happened where they got a goal, you know, in the first 15 seconds there. But, uh, you know, we, we battled back. I thought we did a lot of good things. Um, you know, we uh, obviously, especially, especially the teams, uh, power play scoring. You know, that's, uh, I think that's a good confidence builder for a group. Penalty kill, I thought it did, did a really good job against uh, a really good power play. Um, you know, we just got to stick with it, you know, uh, just continue to uh, make sure we're, you know, our details in our game are great on a nightly basis and um, continue to, you know, get pucks around the net. Obviously, you see some of the, the bounces and, you know, that's, that's, uh, that's on a nightly basis in this league, you know, it's whether it's off a stick or skate or whatever. So we just got to continue to, to shoot pucks and, um, you know, make sure we're, we're really good in the ozone. Um, it was the, first of all, a good play by Franz. Um, I think he was looking shot and went back up to the top to Croner. And Croner made a great play by faking the one-timer and the goalie went down and I don't think he realized that the puck came over to me. And when I got it, I looked up and I saw a lot of net. So I was pretty grateful for that. Looked like it was tough to handle. Were you surprised you had that much time because I want you to get a hold of it and that was still wide open for you? I was surprised, yeah. Um, you know, I, I got it and I looked up and saw the net was wide open. So it was probably a good idea to shoot it and, and I did. So. How difficult is it when you get down so early in the game that quickly? Um, I mean, it's hard, but um, we've had games like that this season so far and we've come back from it. And, you know, sometimes we don't, like tonight, but. Um, you know, I think getting a, a better start will be a big thing for us in, in the future. And not, you know, going down one nothing really early, and or two nothing, or whatever it might be. And um, you know, maybe starting with a lead that might help us. And you know, I think we dominated most of the game to be honest. So if we can get a lead and keep playing like that, I think we'll be okay. Tough first. There's a great push in the second, and then the rest of the way here tonight. What was the key behind that, Glenny? Yeah, you know. Um... You know, we just got back to playing our game. Um, we got down early and, and had to battle back and uh, didn't quite have enough in the end, which is frustrating. But uh, there's things to build on for tomorrow, for sure. Special teams-wise, especially. You got a shorty of the power play scored here tonight. How key was it in both those areas for your special teams tonight? Yeah, we just got to keep building. Um, we haven't been where we want to be this year, and we still got a long way to go. But, uh, you know, we'll take any building block we can at this point. How tough a night for everybody when you get bad bounces like you did on the first three goals? Yeah, I mean, uh, you can only control what you can control. And, um, you know, we had our chances. And, um, you know, there's things that we can do to eliminate those bad bounces. And uh, we just got to keep working. Look, how important has it been to mean through the, all these frustrating one goal losses to keep coming back the next game and, and doing things right? Yeah, I mean, I think that's the biggest thing. Uh, it's not it's not easy uh, losing as much as we have. But, uh, you know, you can't, you can't lose the the team and um, the culture that this locker room's had for so long and um, doing the things the right way has, has been a part of this team for a long time. So we just got to continue to try to do that. It's just tough when you have to play from behind pretty much all the game. Yeah, you know, like you, you start the game and you're down one nothing before you blink. Uh, not, you know, that's a hard way. You give away the, the goal, basically. Then you kind of rally, you get yourself back into it in the first. I thought we played good for the most part in the first uh, after we kind of caught our breath a little bit after giving up that goal and then you give one up late. So now you've given one up in the first 30 seconds, one in the last 10 seconds. And it's a hard way to win when you're when you're digging out from behind. You know, I thought we were playing good hockey. We get the four on four. Uh, give one up. I didn't think our coverage was great. You know, you can say it was a bad bounce, but that starts with with, with not good enough coverage. No, now you're down three nothing. You're trying to win on the road. Like we we did lots of good stuff. Uh, we played good enough to win the hockey game, but we can't give away goals. If you give away goals like we gave away goals, uh, you give the the three up. It's hard to, to outscore those. So we got to find a way to make sure we're tighter and uh, right off the bat. Has it kind of been too much of the story here lately? Yeah, yeah. yeah you know, uh, I think from a process standpoint, there's tons of stuff that's good, but the outcomes aren't nearly good enough. So we got to make sure we do a better job of uh, uh, making teams earn their, their, their goals. Like, this is a real good team. I thought we did a good job overall eliminating uh, their chances, but uh, you, can't, you can't play from behind that way on the road.